So, whilst Leon has well deserved to lie down after that three mile seven foot on cross country event, I'll do the old roan chase at Liverpool. It's a grade two handicapper at the top, Sapphire and Steel for Martin Needham. Carbon neutral for Graham Clutterbuck, gated complex Darren Thompson, fabulous prospect David Hooley, Northern Life Kevin Minahan, Duffcock Collider for Joshua Sutherland, winner last week, Mercer and Newbis for Graham Clutterbuck, Trick Fantasy Leon Van Rinsberg, Vern Glass, Verglass Alex Cherry, High Admiral Paul Rhodes, Sacra Castles for Alex Cherry and Warburn for Paul Rhodes. So a decent sized field for this one then. And grade 2 handicap, now away they go. And looks like High Admiral and Carver Neutral. I might be disputing the lead along with Mirza Anubis. This might give us some pointers to the Macus next week. And it's Mirza Anubis who's gone on into a two length lead then as they make their way to the first of the 14 fences. Very different track now this of course to Cheltenham for the Mackerson. This is a much stiffer, or well, much sort of faster track if you like. Mirza and Nubis is six or seven lengths clear. It'll be a much stiffer test next week at Cheltenham, but I'm sure some of these will turn up all that prestigious handicap next week and they're all over the second. And it's Mirza and Nubis who's six lengths clear of High Admiral in second. And Duffcock Collider is third. As they get over the third, and all safely over it with gated complex, just the back marker. And Mercer and Newis it is then. And bowls along in the lead and gets over the fourth. A bit of a mistake at the buzzer. Four at the back. Sacra Castles has gone, so Sacra Blur, I nearly missed it, but Sacra Castles has gone, and Alex Cherry's charge is out of the race, unfortunately for him, but he's got another one which is Verglas, and that one's up there in third. So it's Mercer and Nubis then the leader, as they get to the fifth. All over that, I was like nearly missed the fall as I was busy watching Leon Van Rensburg's trick fantasy make a dreadful mistake. Uh, they're quite well strung out now, as they come down towards the sixth, and Mercer and Nubis lands in the lead from Verglas in second, then Duffcock Collider is in third, and then High Admiral four, Sapphire and Steel, the top light moving around the outside of Carbon Neutral, then Warbird and Northern Life Gated Complex is chasing them, Trick Fantasy is towards the back, and they pop over the seventh with Fabulous Prospect, just the back marker. They're passing the water jump and the winning post then now. And there was a time when they used to take the Grand National Water Jump and these ordinary mild may fence chases, but they don't do that these days. And Mirza and Nubis is the leader by about four or five lengths to High Admiral who's in second. Then there's a line of about four of them together. Sapphire and Steel, Duffcock Collider, Verglas and Northern Life. Tucked in behind them is Carbon Neutral, the stable companion of the leader. The grey on the outside is Warbird for Paul Rhodes. And then the back three of Gated Complex, Fabulous Prospect and finally Trick Fantasy in the dark blue with a yellow cap. But it's Mirza and Nubis who's been in the lead all the way and leads by about two lengths to High Admiral in second as they get over the eighth. And Duffcock Collider going well in third. And Carbon Neutral and Northern Life and Warbird closest to us. Sapphire and Steel just drop back a little bit under a big weight as they take the ninth. And over that one they all go with Gated Complex, the new back marker. And Mercer and Newis skips over the tenth. But out jump there by Duffcock Collider who's now I was going to challenge the lead, they take this sharp turn and drop back to a share of second with Carbon Neutral. So Mirza and Nubis is the leader, Carbon Neutral's gone second, it's a clutterable one-two at the moment as they get over the 11th. And over that one they go and it's Mirza and Nubis is kicked on, Carbon Neutral chasing in second. Then comes Duffcock Collider who's suddenly looking a bit one pace. Verglass is trying to run on, then High Admiral Warbird is still trying to get going, Sapphire and Steel anchored by the big weight. Trick Fantasy is trying to run on, Gated Complex is next, Northern Life and Fabulous Prospect are beaten over the third last they go and it's Mirza and Nubis fabulous prospect gone at the back there and it's Mirza and Nubis who's in the lead now being chased by Verglas and Warbird as Carbon Neutral drops away Duffcock Collider's trying to get going again they come down towards the second last and it's Mirza and Nubis who's over it four lengths clear of Warbird in second Sapphire and Steel bravely trying to run on High Admiral on the outside Duffcock Collider trying to get back into it there's only one more fence to take and it's a very short run in and Mirza and Nubis looking like it's only got to jump the last 
Murder Anubis comes to the final fence in the old road chase, skips over it, gets away from it. Well, Trick Fantasy's running off from absolutely nowhere on the outside. That was Stone last not long ago, but he's not going to get to the leader. And it's Murder Anubis that wins it. Trick Fantasy second, then Duff got Collider Gated Complex also ran on well. And one or two of those will definitely perform better at Cheltenham next time. And if they go, of course, but Murza Anubis has taken it today for Graham Clutterbuck. Trick Fantasy for Leon Van Rensburg, really finishing well in second. Duffcock Collider for Joshua Sutherland was third. Warburn for Paul Rhodes was fourth. And Gated Complex for Darren Thompson was fifth.